Hey guys, this is Bagrichor Gaming. Please don't mind the quality of this video as I'm stuck here in my family house away from my PC. But this problem needs a solution right now. So let's talk about it. So you have installed a game that you have been trying to play for a while now. But as soon as you click the play button, this error shows up that says the application was unable to start correctly 0xC00007B. Click OK. To close the application. Now believe me this problem can be a real pain in the ass. There are many videos on YouTube addressing the same issue and its various solutions. I myself have tried all these solutions and most of them ask you to download or update DirectX and or other system softwares. But if you have tried the solutions and the problem still persists then you my friend have come to the right place because this is the final solution or rather solutions as I will be showing you two solutions for this problem and if these two don't work then believe me no other solution will but before starting the solutions I would rather ask you or recommend you to try the other solutions or fixes that are already present on YouTube before trying these final two so here we go the first solution is quite easy as you just need to install a new and clean window that's it as simple as that but if you don't have a new window CD or due to some reason don't want to install one then you should try the next solution now this next solution or fix can be a little dangerous and I would recommend you to make a copy of the system 32 folder somewhere safe I myself tried this solution after failing multiple times trying all the other solutions available on YouTube but this one worked for me. All you need to do is find someone who has the same windows operating system as you. In my case I had a friend who had the same windows 7 ultimate 64 bit operating system. I just asked him to give me a copy of his system 32 folder and I copied its content into my system 32 folder. That's it and the problem was gone. Make sure to override the files if a windows pop up and ask you for skipping or overwriting the duplicate files. I would also recommend you to copy the contents of the folder rather than copying the entire folder itself. I hope this worked for you. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.